As I was talking to Todd from Statement, we have some very exciting news. Statement is actually being brought to the next level by this gentleman, one of the most, I would say, legends in the voting industry. Not to make you blush, but my goodness, Mr. Craig Berry, how are you, sir? I'm fine, thank you. And you? I don't know about the legend part of it. Uh... <laughs> I don't know. All I know is all the people walking around, they're high-fiving you, they're taking photography of you. You pretty much are a superstar at this show, Craig. Well, that means uh, I'm an old person. <laughs> I don't think that so. means it's been around think... too long, no too many people. And I have boat show voice, as you can tell. <laughs> well, that boat show voice is working it because it, 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 I'm telling you, I've never seen so many people on a statement before. Well, you know something? There have been a lot of people on the statements, and I'm proud to be part of Statement Marine because of Nick and Todd giving me the opportunity to, you know, do what I do. And boy, and, you, you do it well. Well, even when I came in the boat show here, when they arrived, I had someone say to me, hey, those boats must be done by Craig Barry. They have that certain look to them. Yes. So it's, it's a team effort. We have good people there at the, at the factory right now and everything else like that. Uh, they allowed us to change a few things and when you bring this type of product in it really shows the creativeness that you have and what you can deliver and I'm glad that you guys are happy. Well and can I actually ask you to take us a little bit back into the history because you actually developed the Ocean Hawk when it was called a cigarette. Cigarette. <laughs> <laughs> Craig, can I just pick your brain for our viewers? Because this, okay. this is really some Well, the Ocean Hawk is really a 28-foot cigarette performance boat. Right. You used to have two small blocks in it. And what we did is that kind of in the late 80s, you said, maybe we go to the center console business. And we cut the back off, moved it back. And you can tell where it ends and where it begins and made a center console out of it, took it to the boat show, sold about half a dozen or seven or eight of them, um, and then came along and made that little uh, bullet, 31 bullet, and replaced it, and then sold these molds. But you can always tell a cigarette mold because that knuckle on the top or a knuckle on the side. And so the Ocean Hawk, when I saw this here and came in the other day, I was like drawn back a bunch of years. But you know something? They run, they still run true, they still run great and great boat. And built by one of the legends <laughs> of just a few years ago. A few years ago. <laughs> but actually people are just, they're in awe because the, the loyalty and the nostalgia that goes along with the cigarette oh, yeah. center yeah. console. Well, you something know, you're a big part of. Well, I was, you know, I was president of cigarette for many, many years, but someone came in the boat show and said to me, that's a cigarette. And I said, how did he know that? But he knew that, and it was from one of these other booths, one of these other manufacturers. They knew that. There was a cigarette. So tell me, what are we looking forward to? What's going to be in Miami, Craig? Can you even give me a little bit for our viewing audience? Well, we're going to have, in Miami, we're going to have um, 35, obviously, 38, obviously. And we're going to bring Forever Young down, which is a, a center console that we developed with a big tuna tower on top as a fish boat. Nice. And we're going to bring the tower up and everything else and bring it down there and uh, display it in the Miami Boat Show. Team statement. <laughs> well, we're ready. Well, As always, they're going to push it to the limit and make that statement. Well, thank you very much. Thank you, Craig.